The strawberry season is here again, and many families will want to stock up on the fruit, but also head out to a leisure farm to pick their own. Let's meet a young strawberry farmer in Xinju who has a background that might surprise you. He was headed for a very different career when he decided the farming life was his calling. The young man crouched in the greenhouse to pick strawberries is not on a pick-your-own holiday. He's the boss of the farm. 35-year-old Xie Jingyuan is a former STARS student with a Master of Science in Management from Boston University. But on returning to Taiwan, he decided on a complete career change to the shock of his family. At first, they found it hard to understand, of course. Mostly, they thought I was trying to escape the pressures of the job hunt or something, so they would say things like that. But after a year or two, they realized I wasn't just messing around. She has set his heart on organic farming, but with no experience, he first completed a year's apprenticeship at another farm. Then he decided to create this organic strawberry farm in Xinju's Guanxi Township. He was named one of Taiwan's top 100 young farmers in an annual award ceremony. Basically, everything you're looking at here is the apple strawberry variety. They have several good qualities, such as firm flesh, which is an advantage in deliveries because they hold up better during shipping. In developing the business, Xie has also planted the vanilla strawberry variety, which smells super sweet and is less sour than other types. He uses LED lights to give them the best care. These are our grow lights. With strawberries grown in greenhouses in the north in winter, there is quite a high chance they won't get enough light because of bad weather. Especially with this very mainstream variety, the vanilla strawberry, it can easily change color if it doesn't get enough light. It can go kind of pale white and then it loses its market value. Xie makes sure to use the best technology to help his strawberries grow, in the process proving that just because you're a star student, it doesn't mean you're necessarily destined for life in an office.